Hey everybody, how's it going? It's Music with Todd Ledbetter and we are back with some Opeth tonight. We are going to do Serenity, Painted Death. Uh, we've been working on the Still Life album and we are all the way down to uh, number six in the uh, track order and there's only seven. So we've almost completed this album. Maybe we'll just do that today. Uh, we have a white cluster after this. So we've done the more uh, God's... Uh, Godhead's Lament, Benighted, Moonlapse Vertigo. I love that song. Faces of Melinda, Face of Melinda, good song. So we're at Serenity Painted Death. Uh, and let's get right into it and check this one out. I'm super excited for it. All right, here we go. right in with it. Take this out with that acoustic guitar, a couple little notes. Cool lick. Well, I got Some Alice in Chains harmonies there. I like that. There's that acoustic.
Is that it? I guess are so. Are you interested? No, 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 not you. All right. Well, caught me off guard there. Um, that was cool. I really like that. That was that. I mean, that started off just like the bass and the drums were so good in that song, and the bass was a little bit kind of back in the mix because the guitar was so wet. It was a very interesting tone in that, but um, the bass was really intricate uh, as, uh, as well as the drums. Um, I was really listening to that, but the guitar was killer. Um, I loved um, several of those riffs that um, the, the electric guitar was really, really interesting. And the lead guitar was fantastic. It was really good. There was a towards the later third of the song there was quite a ripping lead and he was just like playing playing good that was really good um the growling vocals uh was really interesting to me because there was like three different sort of styles he used you know i don't know if he was in a conversation or something like that back and forth but he used a couple uh different uh sort of tones and then also at one point the growling was was really rhythmic almost like almost like a rap in a way but it was but not obviously a rap but it but it, it was rhythmic like a rap might be um i thought that was very clever and very interesting and very appealing um and of course uh to go along with uh the different tones that he was growling in and uh, the the ending of the song was great just that they're so complicated god man that acoustic guitar with that electric guitar just kind of finished off like the last minute of the song uh that was really really nice but odd too i mean not odd in that it was unusual that they did it but the chords were odd and the structure of that of those chord progressions was very uh it was very odd and as a lot of the songs are it's obviously done on purpose to give you sort of that uneasiness i think uh sort of that feeling of apprehension and and uh, you know the still life <laughs> That was a really good song though man i enjoyed that thoroughly that was that was a good cranking rock song man a lot of good stuff in there can't get over the way he was growling and, and the different tones he used in that sort of rhythmic growling he was doing i can't remember it really but it was like something like that and it's hard for me to remember because i'm not good at it but uh this is my first time hearing the song so but i just remember that was impressive and i thought it was unusual and different in the song uh and really set apart from like any other growling i've heard in the album and maybe even i've heard him do a couple different things with the growling i've noted before in, in a few songs uh can't remember which ones but uh that was very different anyways to get off the growling uh, that was pretty cool i liked it a lot um yeah we're getting right on down to the wire with the still life album so uh let me know what you think. I know that you like Still Life. I know that you like Opeth, but let me know in the comments anyways uh, where you are with this song. How does this uh, song stack up to some of the other songs in the album? Um, yeah, I can't wait to see how they close this out. Um, we're going we're gonna to get to that right now on the next uh, video. So looking forward to that. So thank you guys very much. I've been enjoying this album thoroughly. I don't think there's... And there hasn't been any disappointment at all. It's been like a perfect, perfect album. Each song, the song listing, the tracking, the way that the songs play and doing each other. It's been really good. I really enjoyed it. All right. So we'll uh, catch you guys down in the comments. Thank you guys for uh, clicking and watching the uh, video. And we will see you later.